All right. We're back on the strap. The chin uh, strap. You ever seen those porn videos where they strap uh, a dildo on their face? No. Okay. Well, that's the end of that conversation, though. Does that, like, do they put, like, a GoPro on it? No, no. That'd be kind of cool. Why haven't, like, has anybody done that? They should do that. GoPro uh, dildo face? Well, like, you know, put one on a dildo and then, like... Oh, and push it in? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, they've done something like that. I don't think it was a GoPro because GoPros are decently large. Yeah, I mean, I'm not saying, like, obviously you're not going to put the whole thing in somebody. But I mean, like, you know, like, just put it on the end of it and then it's like, you know. For the, that'd be for the people who like want to want to be in it. Yeah, you know what I mean. Literally. Yeah. Hi, <laughs> Alex. I'm Rosie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, just starting off with some light porn talk. Yeah, that's all. You know, just starting off. You gotta, you gotta shoot this thing in the middle of the lineup. That's right. Up. That's right. Yeah. You just get your fireball going. Getting that fireball. <laughs> Getting that fireball. I, I can't believe it. I've never thought of that. That's a brilliant idea. I think. Well, because I've seen videos of people, like, they put, like, a GoPro on the end of, like, a microphone. Yeah. And, like, the dude's, like, you know, they got a show, and he's, like, screaming into the microphone. Like, wow. That's pretty cool. Like, you know, it's a, it's a camera angle that was never before possible. You know what I mean? Yes. And then I've seen them do it with, like, a drummer, and when, like, they put it on, like, his arm, and then you see him, like, drumming. Like, that's, you know. I think that's a cool idea. Do you have to go from the top now? I might have to. Oh, maybe it just isn't activated yet. Oh, there's a switch somewhere. There's a switch either on the bottom or, like, on the wall somewhere, I think. On the wall, uh, either down or up top. Because, yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to shoot that in the middle, but I think you got to, like, activate it or something first. There's a switch on the wall somewhere. Oh, Billy, there's this one band... I wanted to bring up to you that I have discovered recently as a result of Melissa showing it to me, actually. Um, she showed me this band. They're pretty fucking cool. Um, they're called Crownlands. Crownlands? And it's a two-piece band from Toronto. Okay. And they sound a lot like Rush. And the, the best part about this band is that it's two dudes. That's it. Just two dudes? Two dudes. Uh, so there's, there's a drummer... And he's the vocalist, okay. and he's got a crazy, like, Getty Lee voice. Sounds almost just like him. And the guitar player, half the time, has, like, a double-neck guitar. So he's got, like, a guitar on one neck and then a bass on the other. And then he's doing that foot pedal thing where he's playing, like, the keyboard with his feet. Oh, okay. And then he's also got keyboards that he plays sometimes, too. And, like, the, the, the wild thing about it is just that it's two dudes playing, and it sounds fucking crazy. Just two dudes playing. They just put out a new. Crazy. They just put out a new record. I think a couple weeks ago, maybe a couple months ago. Um, and the opening track is eighteen and a half minutes long. It's fucking sick. So if you're interested, you should check them out. Okay. Where? Deep switch. Look behind the boxes. I think it's like behind the boxes somewhere. I think there's a switch. I'm pretty sure there is. Well, maybe it's on top of the boxes. On top of some of the boxes. Did you look there? Because it's not upstairs. You said right. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing up here. So it's got to be on top of one of the boxes or something. Oh, it's that. You see that? Like, that's stupid. There's a switch there. You uh, stand on it. So go stand on it. Okay. That's dumb. That is Because that's on a box. Like, why would that be a mechanism? That makes no sense. That is so dumb. There you go. Oh, so you got to shoot it where it stops and then it lines up. Okay. Let's start from the bottom, probably. There you go. I don't know how the how this is lining up here. I don't get it. Oh, you got it. You know what you're doing. Oh, he's really the fucking lead strat master now. Yeah. Now you got it. Now fuck. Well, that's a classic rare where fucking error sound. Did you hear that shit? I did. The wee-wall. Wee-wall. Shoot out! <laughs> it's a dragon! <laughs> it's a dragon snake. And we're five minutes in. <laughs> uh, we talked about... Crownlands. Uh, 
<laughs> well, then face dildos. <laughs> And so we searched the room. So we've covered the spectrum, really. Yeah. <laughs> on one end, face dildos. On the other band, Canadian rock band. Yeah. So, you know, two diametrically opposed situations and all that. So, yeah. Yeah, I'd say so. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why? <clears throat> You're the one who did this. Why are you asking? <laughs> you did this to yourself. Shut up, dude! Shut up. Shut up, and I'm talking to you. I should listen to that album not too long ago. That album holds up. It's fucking great. I don't even know who the fuck it is. That's Linkin Park, man. Is that Linkin Park? That's Linkin Park's first record. Hybrid Theory. Or like Linkin Park. That's uh, um, <laughs> One Step Closer. That's the song. And I'm about to... Uh, yeah. That's that song, too. <laughs> <laughs> it's not what I want. I want to. I wanted to fucking whatever. Fuck you, bad bitch. What can you say to me? Shut up. Shut up when uh, you're talking to me. Shut up. <laughs> Just like b- b- you know what I also heard. There was a remix album that they did called Reanimation. Um, and they the took animation, no breathing. Oh, that was a mistake. You shouldn't. That was a mistake. <laughs> um, yeah, there was a remix album that they did um, called Reanimation. Like I think it came out a couple of years after Hybrid Theory, and I didn't. I had never heard it. Um, Who, who's the mistake here now, Taylor? Huh? Hmm? Ah, yeah. <laughs> Not me. I'm the winner. I get the scarab. But yeah, there was a. In the album that they put out, and uh, they had a bunch of people remix their songs, and it was cool. Everything you scream at me, I don't hear because I have a hearing problem. Every barrel you throw at me (laughs) brings me one step closer, and then I realize this is not Donkey Kong. It's the same pattern every time. Wow! And the the easy solution is to just not yeah just take the damage just, just take that shit just take the damage exactly <laughs> it's not putting me you know uh. back or I'm not holding a barrel that explodes <laughs> the test of fear I'm great at these ones no these are this one sucks I face my fears all the time you stand and face your deepest fears yeah I just tank the shit. No, you got to keep the guy. You know how like you did the with the the flaming of the guys in the last one. You got to do the same thing, but you got to keep use the stick to keep that line in the line or in the green or whatever. This would be great if it were like, um, what's it called, Jurassic Park or something. Yeah, it would. It'd still be a terrible mechanic. Yeah, I know. But I mean, like, the scenario. Like, just, like, the visual of it. Like, would be a lot cooler if it were, like, you know... Um... Jurassic Park. Yeah. I would agree. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. There's one more big, big, scary, spooky man. There he is. You know, the worst thing is, like... It makes it so you can't even watch. I know. So what's the point of any of this if you're going to be watching? Dude, it was 2002. They tried their fucking best, all right? I think that's the end. Yeah, yeah you did it. Woo! See, I'm great at these. What'd you call me? Anus? Oh, Billy, once I release the episode, you can watch that thrilling cutscene. I'm not going to. <laughs> after, after I film these, I'm done. Like, I don't, I don't think about anything... <laughs> <laughs> I do. <laughs> I exist entirely separately from the stupid show that we do every fucking time we hang out. <laughs> I'm here to say what's up, <laughs> to crap my pants, <laughs> yeah, to shit my pants, talk about things, and then forget about it. Uh-huh. And then my sister's like, "That was a really weird episode. You guys are talking about doing trickies, mom, too much." And I'm like, "Oh yeah, we did talk about that." <laughs> I could refresh my memory if I want, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna, because I don't need to. Because <laughs> I don't care! It, you know, it reduces the integrity of the show if I recycle the jokes because I said them before. 
I already As do it enough. As if we haven't fucking done that like so many times before. <laughs> I already do it enough because <laughs> I say the same shit all the time. Yeah. Billy, have you tried the new Mountain Dew Summer Freeze? What the fuck did you just call me? Have you tried it? No. There's a summer freeze? Yeah. Summers don't freeze. What the fuck are you talking about, yeah, but Mountain it's trying Dew? To keep, it's trying to keep you cool. Mountain Dew, this is not how you get to the youth. There was another one that they just released, I think. Another flavor. Probably like Quantum Solace. <laughs> James Bond flavor. <laughs> Just tastes like sweat. <laughs> I was gonna say that'd be the whiteout, and it'd just be his cum. <laughs> oh, well, there you go. You can leave. That'll open. <laughs> That's right, because I was like, "How did we leave?" Yeah. Uh, I think I go back to. You gotta go- <laughs> 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 you gotta, yeah, you gotta go back to Thorntail Hollow. <laughs> Quantum Solus flavor mountain. <laughs> You gotta check the out sometime. Why don't you just you remember, tell you remember me where when they go. used to do the game fuel? Like they did like the Halo themed game fuel for a while. Yeah. They need to, I don't know. I am not saying they need to do that again. I didn't really like I mean that flavor is okay. But like Anne I just, loves gamer. I just like the, the branding. I thought the branding was cool. That's all. Yeah, Anne loves fucking gamer fuel. Oh, does she? Yeah, she loves that shit. She's like, ooh. Yes, like that. Roll the game of you. Like that specific Mountain Dew. Yeah. Do they still make like it? the cherry one? They still make it. Yeah. yeah oh, is it the? Oh, is it like the the energy yeah, one? Right. Um, no, no. It's a. Uh, it's just called Gamer Fuel, and it's like red cherry or oh. black cherry. Or it's some cherry. It's like uh, fire, fiery cherry. Gotcha. I tried some. They had some um, Mountain Dew uh, energy drink ones that I had gotten recently. It was, I think, a. A grape and then the watermelon. A grape? Yeah, it was okay. It was was all right. See, I don't like watermelon. I don't either, but I just figured I'd try it. I saw it at Kroger. I'm like, yeah, I'll get some. Watermelon. I'm I'm a a Kyle. I I still love my fucking monster because I'm a loser. (laughs) I don't don't drink those drinks. I'm like, it's stupid. It's stupid because I drink them for the fucking taste. (laughs) Yeah, no. (laughs) Like, which is like the dumbest thing. Yeah. But I like the way they taste. taste. I'm sorry, man. Same thing with like Red Bull. Like I like the way it tastes. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't like it either. I just don't no, like I energy know. drinks because they just don't taste good to me. I know, and that's fair. They don't taste great, but I I like the taste of yeah. them because I'm a loser. So, well, you know, yeah, you gotta talk to this guy. I, I missed it. Uh, How'd you miss that? <laughs> I was just thinking. Uh, I was thinking there was another like little outlet. Uh, don't you wave your fucking hands at me? Oh God! Where do I want to go? Do I want to go Ice Mountain? Are you ready? I did hit it. <laughs> Why? No, hit that square, square. There you go. Okay. I was thinking it was gonna say Ice Mountain or some Are bullshit like that. You have two cheat tokens you could put in the game well if you want. <laughs> I know. I'm like I got my stoner eyes inadvertently. On. <laughs> yeah, I'm inadvertently adding more padding to this game that's already full of it, but. You've got two chi tokens that you can drop Let in. Let me there. go under your tummy. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a loser. I, I like monster oh, energy drinks. So. Uh, I'm sorry. Taylor. I hope that doesn't change how you view me. Taylor. <laughs> Taylor. Fuck. Taylor. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I can't. Just fucking stop. All right. Ooh. Where am I going? Just go until you get there. I don't know where I'm at. Left wall strats. Yeah, I think you're there. I think you're doing it. Nope, that's the exit. I have released my soul. I'll just look at the thingy. There's, I don't think there's a map. Well, I meant like oh, when like I'm on when the, you're top on the top thing. there. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what the. I always forget what the cheat tokens do. I don't think it's worth it. But you've got them in there. You might as well get them out of your inventory. Because why don't you dumb. say the words that you say? <laughs> That, that has always happened. That was baked into the game. Like, the actual final release. Do you remember that time period? Like, that period of time, like, where... When companies would make a video game. When they released it, that was it. Yeah. There was no patches. There was no going back. Like, that's it. Yeah, you just fucking, like... 
Where the fuck is it? Is it over there? I think it's to the right. I think it's like pretty central. I think it's like over there. See, like that whole thing is like pretty big. I think it's that. Yeah. Okay, so I think you were almost there. This maze is like generally not that difficult to navigate, but I don't know. I went right and I needed to go left. Okay. Yeah, just you basically just go until you get there. <laughs> At least that's what I like my experience with it. Yeah, left well strats. Yeah. Yeah, see, I don't know, like, that's that's a thing that, like, um, I don't know, like, I, I, it's hard to kind of imagine now that, like, a game um, launches, and then that's just it. So if they missed any glitches, if they missed any things like that, then there's nothing that they can do. Yeah. There's no recourse, there's no patching, there's nothing. The game is just out for the world to experience. And then you get games like Cyberpunk, and it's like, okay... Yoki. I still haven't played that game. I have. I've it looked, beaten it. It looks fine. I just I was if I ever did check it out, I would obviously wait for like a patched version. Nah, it's been patched to high hill. It's like yeah. it's definitely playable now. Yeah. Uh, definitely see, a computer. But see, that's where like games like they're like developers like Capcom have been fucking killing it lately, is because like every game they release recently is like a full like full fledged game with like no issues on launch. Like and, and I, I think they should be fucking commended for that because it's like <laughs> it happens so infrequently in like the larger scheme of like, you know, video game development cycles. Like it probably helps that I think do they, do they they publish their own games, right? I believe so. I yeah. believe so. That's probably why. Do it. What happened? Okay. Do the other one. Okay. All right. Okay. <gasps> oh. It's his dad. Oh. <laughs> what was the cheat, though? <laughs> I don't know. PDA? No. It's not PDA. You already had that. That's a fun little Easter egg, though. You get the dad. Trust yeah. your instincts. That's classic. That's pretty cool. Trust. Too bad they didn't even bother to voice over that, but that's okay. Yeah, you know, it's fine. Whatever. Well, I guess I'll figure it out if uh, if I cheat. That's what I'm saying. I don't think the cheat tokens really do much in this game at all, but whatever. No, well, there was an Easter egg cheat. So there was an Easter egg cheat. That's fucking That's at least cool. something. Oh. I guess. Okay. Right, now you can go back to the Krizuba the Plalis, and then... Uh, Krizuba Plalis! <laughs> That's not what I remember being called. Ooh, meat like you, sweeties, yum! God, it could have been anything. Just fucking. Are you ready to go? Oh, did you say it now? How do you speak and articulate? Yes. You don't have a tongue. I like to think that uh, instead of like magic or anything, he just. Yeah, he just throws in. <laughs> fucking whips you. <laughs> yeah, and then you just cut to this. He's like, ah. I like how this space is a tube. That's funny. Space is a tube, except it's actually a square. It's just the same texture repeating. Uh, they, they get pretty lazy here towards the end of the, like the later parts of this game. I think like this is around the time when they kind of started to phone it in in the course of like what you do. Because right after you do the spell stone, they're like, here's a thing to get to the next Krizoa spirit. Done. Yeah, totally and then you're already here. Like, like within the past hour, we have already done that stuff. All right, so find it. Uh, I think you got to go up one more level. I'm gonna just wager that you got to go up one more level. Probably. Um, I think there's a door or something you got to find that has the the sharp claw disguise button in front of it. That would be my guess, because they have these laid out in, in such a ah. stupid fashion that it's impossible to know where you're going. Yeah, I was right there. It is. Told you. And this Speed is where run. you do it. Speed. Run. This is where Speed you do run. it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There, we're done with this part of the game. Sick. <laughs> Speed. <laughs> Except you gotta fucking watch it three fucking times. Yeah, well, they gotta make it dramatic, dude. Yeah. Oh. I was already high. It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. See, that was like no time in between, like, yeah, doing the spell stone and then getting another Kazoa spirit. Like, that's like 
That was kind of stupid, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. yeah it was just very quick. I can't wait until I can fucking go on our tits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, dude, that's what that's what he's doing this for. Is I don't care about saving the planet. I don't care about doing any of that stuff. I just <laughs> wanted to see them fucked. <laughs> she's gonna come out and she's gonna be like, my savior. And I'm gonna go. Brr. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. She might smack me, but it's <laughs> way Save worth the game. it. Because that's you what I go, like. You gotta go talk to that guy over there. Because that's what I like. I like getting smacked around while I. Brr. Yeah. Shut up. Yeah, you gotta talk Shut to this guy. They're trying to steal his babies. Camel. Why do you sound like a posh female? Please help. Who's doing it? All right. So Bigly, this is like a stupid. Mini game. You gotta hit the guys when they come down. Just hit them. <laughs> hit them. What would probably be good here is the um, the earthquake. That probably would be pretty good. <laughs> if you hotkey the earthquake, you might. Oh no! 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 Yeah, but you gotta... Okay, whatever. Well, there you go. Well... That's what I'm saying. Like, you can you can do it pretty easily by just hitting them, but if you get overwhelmed, you can always do, like, a kill-all with the Earthquake. Like, right now, that's a good opportunity for the Earthquake, I think. There you go. Because the Earthquake doesn't hit the eggs for some reason. Or you can just do it again. Do it again. There you go. This is this is it. This is the game that you wanted to see, Alex. Right here. Well, maybe this will be that stupid ability to let you open up the the, the tech doors. Why didn't he help at all? Who? The dinosaur. Just fucking stand there, one of them, and just go. Yeah, right. I believe inside there is something that you see. Oh, you want me to come into your hole? You, lady, I don't want to get in your cloaca. <laughs> I mean, I've already had lady? the queen, so like. <laughs> Ew, I don't want to get in your cloaca, that's gross. Whoops, I swept in. <laughs> Ew, lady. Why is, uh, why is Fox a uh, surfer, surfer bro? No, I'm quoting, I'm quoting uh, Mark Wahlberg from uh, The Happening. Oh, God. No. <laughs> yeah. No, lady, no. Why would I... No, I've never thought about murdering you in your sleep with a hammer. The hand. plants are killing people. No! No! What? No! I always liked that one shot from that movie. Like, they always played it in trailers where the people are, like, jumping off the building. They're, like, falling yeah, yeah. toward the camera. Like, the camera's facing directly up, and then they're, like, leap, like jumping off the building. I always thought that was pretty cool, but, like, um, yeah. The rest of that, the story was really dumb in that movie. <laughs> yes. <laughs> like, oh, the plants... Like, okay. The plants are angry at the human race. Yeah. So now it's gonna oh, I'm Jesus. Oh, it's just like it's just like a really weird explanation for why that happens. So yeah, you got that stupid portal thing that I told you about. See you later, bitch. You should <laughs> save the game. Save. <laughs> Alright, now now is actually the time to go see Turkey's mom. So next time on Shinstrap Chapter, we're gonna go do that, that Chloe. <laughs> yep. Yeah.